Okie dokie YouTube, I'm going to show you guys how to run Mortal Kombat 4 on Vista for the PC. Now there's been a lot of hoopla about it having to be patched or whatever for Vista, but it doesn't have to. I found this at a website. It was on a board, so I figured I'd post it on YouTube on how to do it. Okay, what you want to do is you want to, you can start the exe file if you want right now, but we don't need it right now. So, we'll just, we'll just put it right there. This will be a two part video because I want to split it up. Okay, you want to go into the data folder, copy everything that's in the folder inside the folder, not the whole folder, just what's inside right here. Copy everything in there. Okay, and you want to make a new folder and call it MK4 or something along the lines of that. Okay, like I did right there in my local C drive. And you want to paste it. I'll take about three minutes to do. Once this is done, um, I'll show you how to make it run because this, this is step one. Part of step, I should say probably step two. Well, I guess it can all one be big, one big step. It's, it's really not that hard. I'll post the link to the original board too, just so you can read what I what I did basically. But it even says you don't need the patch. But um, I don't know if this is because of my disc being dirty, but some of the scenes, like in the endings and stuff, they skip. I don't know if it's because of my disc being scratched up or what. Or that might be a side effect of it being on Vista. Probably my disc, but I'm just throwing that out there maybe, but that, that might be a problem. Okay. Now that that's all copied, what you want to do is you want to click on the EXE file and rename it Mortal Kombat 4. dot exe and then press enter. Now you want to go back to your um, setup and since hybrid hands up I have to do it this way switch to okay then you want to click install then browse then go wherever you put the folder Get rid of all this. At the beginning, I, it doesn't say do that, but I just did just in case. Click install now. Then you'll get the error message and stay tuned because I'm going to um, make another video and splice it in. So just be ready. Okay, now that this this part came up, if you can see it. Press Control, Shift, and Escape. Then, in this process, and then. It should boot up. Okay, if you can see that, that's what it looks like booted up. See, I don't know if it's my disc or if it's... But it boots up perfectly. So, that's how you make...
MK4 work on Vista. If you have any issues, you can PM me, comment on there. Say, hey, I have issues with this. Or, yeah, whatever. So, thanks for watching. Hope that helps. See ya.